four LSU Tigers have won the Round Rock Classic after their, you know, loss to Iowa, right? It was it was going to be very interesting to see how this LSU team did after a loss. Just was, right? The team was so much hype going into the season with the, probably one of the best rosters in college baseball. How would they handle a loss? That was probably a, a big question, especially since... You know, this game, they had to play their freshman pitcher. So how will would this entire team, you know, act and play? Well, it was very much a, a statement of how this LSU team, you know, plays, how they look, their ideas, everything, in my opinion. And they did it in a fashion that made them win the Round Rock, Round Rock Classic. So let's get into this game, shall we? Roll that intro. Hey guys, Dawson Richard here once again for another LSU baseball video. You guys are killing the views on these videos. Thank you so much. Really don't know what I'm doing to make you view these videos, but as I said before, right? Round Rock Classic win. Very much a great game from the LSU Tigers here. After, you know, their first loss against Iowa. And they're going to have more games like Iowa, right? So it's going to be interesting to see how the LSU Tigers bounce back from a game like that. And I think they did well against Sam Houston. Honestly, they did. Let, let, let's get the notes up here, right? Oh, uh, let's see. Let's see. Like, just from the first inning, right? Brayden Jobert, Jobert blasts a two-run homer. Insane stuff right there, my guys. Like, you could say that was a sign of things to come, but who's who knows, really? It's baseball. Things are weird, different, all that type of stuff, right? You get hot, and then you get cold immediately. Who knows, really, right? And what, what can't... And you know, it was an onslaught. I, I, will, I will straight up say that. This was a blowout win for LSU. That was the only way they were going to win the Round Rock Classic. A blowout victory. Like you put up five in the, in the second inning to give you a 7-0 advantage. And you, and you have eight hits right out the gate. Crazy stuff right there. Um and you can, you know, go through this entire order, and there's probably a hit from every single guy, right? And, and I think the more important thing was, you see the last game with Iowa, right? Very much a weird zone that the umpire gave them. They, their discipline was out of whack because of this. Today, not so much. The discipline returned. They got better. They you know, and with, with this discipline comes more hits and more offensive play for the LSU baseball team. So, great stuff all around, right? And you got to give credit here, right? Joe Bear, as I said before, four for six at the plate. Um, he had his second. He had two home runs this game. Dylan Cruz, five for six, four RBI. Jared Jones, two for four, solo homer, 417 feet. Nice. And as I said before, right, all nine of the Tigers' offensive players scored a hit today. 23 hits in total today. Insane stuff from the offense. Very much the offense that you, you could, you know, say, hey, this is the number one team in all of baseball. You know, college baseball. Very interesting stuff here from the guys. Um. By the third inning, 10-0 Tigers. And, you know, this was, and as I said before, right, they needed, a, well, I didn't say this, right? To win the Round Rock Classic, they needed 11 runs. And they hit that. And, you know, one of the best things about this win was that you got a somewhat longer leash on your freshman pitcher, you know, Casey, I mean, Chase Shores. Chase Shore. So I'm t I was thinking about the uh, San Francisco Giants there. Sorry about that. But yeah, Chase Shores, he he got himself a longer leash, longer cushion to, you know, pitch today. 
was able to battle through adversity. Um, and you know what? You you got to say this about Sam Houston. They're not chumps, right? 64 runs before this. You, you got to give credit where credit is due. But today wasn't their day for Sam Houston. Let, uh, let's see how many wings he went. Um, he was able to go for the order once. But it's replaced by Bryce Collins in the third. As I said before, the game was, you know, LSU victory most of the way. I see. And, you know, there, it, it was a game in which, you know, you didn't have to waste arms. That's very much a good thing for LSU, right? You didn't have to waste arms this game. It went the right way through it all. And let's see here. What else is there? Uh, sorry for this. I'm just making sure I got everyone. Like pitchers, you know, Collins went up three up, three down in the third. Lost control completely in the fourth. Replaced by Garrett Edwards. He three runs came across. But Edwards would throw 3.1. Wait, no, that was for uh, Collins, the, you know, the three runs. But Edwards, he threw 3.1 innings, a one-run ball to continue the strong start out of the bullpen. And now, Tigers got to, are staying in, te- in Texas to face Texas on Tuesday. Going to be a fun game, going to be an interesting game. They got some, you know, fresh arms, right, that didn't need to play in the Round Rock Classic. Going to be an interesting watch. See how they do against Texas. See if any of this momentum carries over. Very much a fun game. Game that the Tigers needed to keep their, you know, message and statement that, hey, we are the number one team in college baseball for a reason. Because of this offense. So, yes, very interesting game. Great, you know, you know, you know, tournament win. I guess you could say this was somewhat like a tournament type thing. But, anyway. Very good win, much needed, all that type of stuff. And now they got to face Texas on Tuesday. But anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know I did. I know you, from the stats of the videos, you guys are liking it as well. So why not give it a sub- subscribe already? Keep up to date with these videos. You know, don't, you know, just worry about what comes up in your recommendations. All that type of stuff, right? But yeah, like, subscribe, comment if you are enjoying this content. It, you know, my not really. Honestly, if you made it this far in this video. Especially if you made it far in the yesterday's video or the video before that. All that type of stuff. But anyway, that has been Dawson Richard. I hope you enjoyed this video. And I will see you guys next time.